Hey, you're a real estate photographer and you're looking for a booking system. Uh, that's probably why you're on this video. Uh, you probably get a lot of your business from word of mouth or referral. Uh, and you're looking to try to have a system online that generates your business. I'm going to go over it right now. One full hour of time. And no, this video is not one hour, but in one hour of time, um, I'm going to show you a client his total investment and how he got a booking system done, customized, integrated part of his site. So here's one of our clients, 360 and back. Check this out. Traditional contact form is what most people have. This is what this guy had originally. And I just want to show you the um, massive stark difference. If this is what you got on your current website, it sucks, right? Contact me, name, phone number, email. A lot of times people will have a little contact button there, right? Like a form to fill out. Um, those forms typically get one or 2% conversion rate, which sucks. A hundred people go to your website. They look through your stuff. They click on your con contact me button and then 98 of them leave, right? If that's your conversion rate and if you have Google Analytics hooked up to it, that's probably around what you're getting. If you don't, then don't tell me everyone calls you. Well, of course people call you because that's the only option you're giving them, right? The issue becomes of the two or three or four people that called, what happened to the other 90 that left your site? Those who are the people we're trying to grab with a booking system. So really quickly, booking system, check it out. Book a shoot. We are going to be going, it's just, it's, it's very plain to actually see the difference between a contact form or just like a contact system, like what these guys had before and a beautiful online booking system. Oh my goodness. Sexy. It's sexy guys. So let's check this out. Residential listing 360 tour package. Um, it looks like this is all editable. This is how he chose to do it. So it looks like he just does different square feet, right? And you can select on it. I know standard amount of port. Boom. There's your price. Nice. Some people don't have prices. They just do this as an order form, right? And they don't even collect credit cards. But in this industry, a lot of agents just put their information in. So I, I, I'd give them the option to buy, right? So let's remove this real quick. We can go to listing photos. Looks like it charges by square feet. Ooh, so nice. Maybe I want listing photos and I want a floor plan. What's that? Premium guide. Ooh, look at that. Look at how nice that is. Oh, oh drone extras. Now, when you're giving people the options like what we're seeing right now, guess what you end up with? Higher dollar amounts. There's a reason why when you go to Amazon and you go to buy a tripod for your camera, they, they give you these other additions. Here's a, have you thought about this little cool handle, right? Or, or here's, a, here's a link to uh, lenses. Whatever the case is, there's a reason they're doing that. Hooks up to his Google Calendar. Ooh, he's booked out. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, let's keep going. Ah, he's not booked out. All right. So this hook syncs to his Google Calendar. No double buckings here. Doesn't happen. Contact form. Guess what? Oh, autofill. You put someone's first name in, first initial, and it autofills out. Now, check this out. Let's say somebody leaves. They're like, oh, 100 bucks. That's too much money. Eh? And they leave this guy's website. I have captured all their information, all of it. The guy, they start getting emails. Hey, Joe, you're on my site looking for a Matterport virtual staging for this service address in blah, blah, blah area. Here's a 10% discount for your first cleaning, right? Always looks like he's got this drift. Um, so guess what? That gets back one in five people that leave the site. They come back and still buy just off of those auto emails going out. All automated. You can edit it, you know? Um, Capture the card number, you would not be charged. Just what he does, it's all editable. This whole system is editable. So um, this is an example of the, the astronomical difference between uh, a contact system and a booking page like this. The owner of this company literally has invested less than a single hour. Um, this whole booking page was built out for him. So it just became, this is how you edit it. This is how you change stuff. What's your pricing um, so that he can now go in and edit and make this however way he wants. But he started with this whole thing pre-built on his website. Um, another thing, check out the cell phone view. 
Um, I don't know if this is going to screw up the, the, the YouTube video or not, right? It's got my ugly mug just sitting there. But you can imagine from cell phone view, ah, look at that. Beautiful. Come on. It's beautiful, right? Um, so the moral of this story is if you are a real estate photographer and you're trying to get business online, and whether you're 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 estimating a website, you got reviews, whatever the case, or you're buying ads, you're buying Facebook ads, you're buying Google ads. If you do not have a booking system that allows your customers to easily see what you have as a product, see the pricing, see your extras, and check out and buy, you're wasting your time. You're wasting your money. You might as well just shut down your website because it, it, it's worthless to people. It doesn't do anything. You're getting that two out of the hundred people. They're like, well, I guess I'll call this guy and find out what he charges. No, come on. Give it the times. Um, go to bizvalet.com and B-I-Z-V-A-L-E-T.com. We got um, a, a free free trial, of course. Everyone does free trials. Uh, we have no contracts. Everything's month to month. And we walk with you hand in hand the entire way. So, um Check it out, guys.